Hey, how's it going? I'm Brendan. I'm Brian, and this is the FFT Dream Team. Uh, ever since the age of dinosaurs, God's creatures have discovered that sound and sight are the most vital to life. We too, as ECEs, yield this same belief as we construct an FFT-based lattice Boltzmann solver, constructing uh, I don't know, beautiful images reminiscent of Van Gogh. Or at least uh, spectra, or uh, uh, um, layers of the earth. Right? Yes, yes. Mm. Now watch as we change the frequency, thereby digging deep beneath Earth's surface, revealing its inner secrets. So you swept the frequency up to a rather high frequency there. Yes, and along the way you can see uh, the dig sites that were carved out. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, so every cycle we go through the entire screen and load all the values from an SDRAM uh, using one single read port and then write them back with one write port. So this is a, a 640 by 480 uh, a cellular automaton that's running at about one frame a second. Yes. And you can inject <coughs> points to the center of the screen. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's what the little thing is in the center there. Yes, and it will grow and disperse its mass. So you got the diffusion part of the lattice Boltzmann working, but you had some trouble getting the 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 flow computation, the collisions and the computations. So what we're looking at here is the diffusion piece of it where the where the velocity is diffusing, diffusing from the bottom of the screen, right? That's uh -huh. Okay. And we can see the, the structure growing there in the, in the center, the new structure. So what, so the, the the, there's a serial bottleneck which is writing out of a, a, a large RAM, right? Yeah. We, uh, we couldn't fit using uh, the on-board or on-chip uh, M10K blocks. So you had to go to off-chip SD RAM. Yes. And so that's, so that's single thread, single read. Right. And In order to speed things up, we load from the SD RAM into a shift register, uh, which is basically three rows which go into a window, um, like a three by three grid, which uh, is what our node solver uses to compute. Yeah, so that has 18, 19, 1920 elements. But, but, but because you have that, it means you only have to do one read Correct. per cell, right? Correct. Okay, so that cuts down the number of reads and writes quite considerably to SD RAM. Uh -huh. Cool. So, so, uh, turn, do you intend to turn this into a Windows screensaver? Yeah. <laughs> In fact, keep your eye out. It'll You'll be see, out, yeah. Uh, next year's students. Next year's students. Okay. It's like a loading screen for uh, Windows. Wait till all the, the fuse to the bottom yeah, before it starts. <laughs> okay, thank you. Yep.